One thing I know you know a lot about. What's that? Is stuffing stuffing butts. Yes, I do. <laughs> I am on the forefront Dude, I'm of the stuffing stuffing king. butts. <laughs> I got my PhD in butt stuffing. Holy fuck! How you... many how many years do you have to go for that? To so become... you're like a are you like a proctologist or? Uh, you be... <laughs> proctologists like want to become the level I'm at. Oh, okay, there you go. Mm-hmm. I went through proctology. I went through analism. That's it's weird. Remember when we were... you have to join? You know, Chris and I are local two Hi. tires. Hi. We were in the TTU, <laughs> and I'm surprised we never heard of you. The tube tying gangsters? <laughs> yeah, we were two, We were in the TTU, the local TTU. It's a union, right? Yeah. Yeah. Back in the, the 446. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. Local 446. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> I'm just surprised we never crossed paths. We never heard of you, but yeah. okay, all uh, right. Yeah, I mean, so you it, were doing that, <laughs> apparently. Okay. okay. <laughs> Go ahead. Yes, mm-hmm. stuff and a whole lot of stuff and yeah, okay, is. yeah, PhD and stuff and stuff. Uh-huh. Yes, it took you eight years. Nine, actually. Nine, uh, and many have. I failed my first test. It's you very, gotta, it's you a very specialized a, field. Yeah, yeah. you it gotta, takes some time. You can't just you can't just get in the game all willy nilly. You gotta, you nah, gotta pay your dues. No, nah, nah. and it, you know you gotta learn the basic uh, fundamentals mm-hmm. of anuses and mm-hmm. you know the different folds, flaps, and muscles therein. But mm-hmm. where it comes tricky is is the anal stuffing part because mm-hmm. you gotta know. Uh, how to work out the sphincter properly, how to bore it out without causing detrimental harm to your patient. Um, then once you relax sphincter muscles and inner linings and all that, then you got to find proper uh, lubricant muscle segments because mm-hmm. they open up not all at one time. Yeah, you got the crew. It's, yeah, it's the crew. It is it's the crew. The crew. And you got to fucking, you got to, Put it in there like a massage him. No, nah, you don't really massage it. It's like a it's like a master key. It is. It's a you, lot like a key. You got to lock it in there, mm-hmm. and you got to get them all in in origin because mm-hmm. they all have strengths and weaknesses. You can't yeah. just bombard them all at one time. You got to find ridges and and things in the things that you Nuances, insert. Yeah. Yeah. So one of the tests was you have to fit a uh, full grown cantaloupe mm. in a twenty four year old patient's anus and you had you had the patient and you had a whole lineup of cantaloupes varying size varying shape varying uh ripeness which Mm. also comes into play uh so you 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 gotta do uh a lot of squeezing testing finding the right ridge unlocking unlocking push that one up in its right origin spread Tank? Are you saying? Blow it out. Are you saying tank manipulation? Like, what are you talking about? Tank manipul. That's a good way of putting it. Yes, tank manipulation. Because you do have to hit the all the parts around. Yeah, it, the the crew encompasses. It's like a, yeah. a bunch of homies locked in arms, but they're all not the same size, build. They all have weaknesses, strengths. Strengths. You have to find all those combinations mm-hmm. to the food crew lock in order to get the cantaloupe in there, and that's the main that's the main okay. test. Yeah, and each and so did you get all twenty cantaloupes in all twenty bottles? <laughs> I, I, the first test, the first test, I failed. Oh, okay, because I was head of my class, so I thought I was a top dog, and mm-hmm. I didn't follow the fucking proper rules and regulations of of food crew one hundred and one, and I figured. Spit, punch, stuff was oh. the best method, and I feel, I feel like you would have learned that on the first day. Not you the would, final you test. would, but it, it's it's, it's <laughs> kind of it's kind of like you one of those things like you, you don't have that you information. Spit, you're like, like you're spit? the academic like... powerhouse throughout the whole college and graduation. Yeah, and you just get cocky. You're like I'm oh, untouchable. I just oh, all yeah. I got to do is fucking you look at it. You thought you could like Happy Gilmore, yeah, that dude. type of thing. If you figure you just roll in there Lost and you just mechanics. You just do it. Yeah. So I got cocky and uh-huh. I just spit punch stuff. Forced stuffed. it. Yeah, you forced it. And now the you know little little the Jimmy is no longer able to. I walk. thought he was twenty four. 
What I mean, we call he him was a, little before he tried to fucking yeah. boot well, his ass with the fucking cantaloupe. Jim, he's little Jimmy now because they had to right. remove the lower part of his colon along with a couple of like vertebrae because it all got damaged. He blew, blew his so back I out. I just want to make sure because you know we are not, we are not supporters of underage cantaloupe butt no, stuff. I, I did say he was 24. Twenty-four year old volunteer. Right, little Jimmy. 